after spending two days in magical El Salvador, our next destination is Tulum, Mexico. Together with my sister Apple, we embark on a journey into the Yucatan Peninsula for four days. Bienvenido a Tulum, Mexico! Welcome to Tulum, Mexico! From Cancun International Airport, my sister and I rode the Ado bus for two hours to arrive to the beautiful paradise of Tulum. On the way to Tulum! This is our room in Tulum. Oh my god, two beds, one for me. And we have like this amazing view of the outside. Ganda Paul! Welcome to Tulum! This is my third time in Tulum. My fifth or sixth time in Mexico. Ta-da! She's got like this, this and hers. One shower here. Well, we can take one shower each. Because it's two. That's two toilets as well. That's what I told you. We have our own. Ta-da. Very nice. Very nice. Very spacious. First stop when in Mexico is Taco. And then off we went to explore the Tulum after a quick shower and late lunch. It's by the road. With people passing by. Welcome to Tulum. This is our first meal. Healthy, healthy. Welcome to Altunha. <laughs> This iconic work of art by Daniel Popper, Ven a la Luz, Come to the Light, is a 10 meter tall sculpture made with steel, wood, rope, and greenery. The sculpture represents the harmony between people and nature and is one of the most Instagrammable spots in Mexico. At night, Apple and I just went for a walk downtown exploring different shops and looking for a good place to eat for a Mexican dinner. So today was fun. It was just me and my sister chilling and relaxing, walking around Tulum. We had a dinner, we had chicken, set up. And then what did you have for breakfast? We didn't have breakfast. Lunch, no? Lunch, very clean and healthy. It's a food truck that's actually on the side of the street with a few tables set up. It was so good. The owner a we talked to, a farm to van set up. So the owner that we talked to used to live in Houston. So there's that common denominator. There's that common denominator. <laughs> <laughs> so we're just chilling. It's still early today, but it feels like it's already like super late because it's the provincial vibes here. But for the most part, we're enjoying Tulum. Mexico is such a nice and amazing country. But it, Expensive taxi though, but the food is amazing. See you tomorrow. Bye. Day two. two. OTD. Going to Azulik, that nest beach. Okay, how do you know? Oh, the guy in the Naya. Bilang nest. In odd. In odd, ba? In odd. What? In homage. In honor of the In odd. Buenos dias! Viva a Mexico! Bienvenido a Mexico! Buenos dias! Buenos dias, yeah. yeah, so the OTD for today, we are going to that famous yes. nest place called Azulik. So yung mga parang nest. When they call it here, El Nido. Nido is like nest. So we're gonna go chill, relax by the beach, white sand beach. Tapos eat. Eat lang tayo. Tapos, you know. Uh, pang Instagram. <laughs> you see my outfit ko? Ang perlas lang sila nga nan ay suot-suot ko. <laughs> Ilalaban natin ito para kay MMD. <laughs> Let's go! Bye!
Welcome to Azule. Sila Julia Barreto, Maha Salvador, nag-stay dito. We're gonna go eat first. This is our view. It's amazing. That's already like the beach. Apple is here. My sister. But the restaurant is so amazing. Parang it's a nest. They call it Nudo. We're like eating inside a nest. But, like this bamboo or rattan. And then it's all like ecologically friendly. Very nice. Paul, what did we order? Taco, chicharron, sundae, and empanadas. empanadas, hamburguesa, shrimp, taco, and then pinakamodas. Yes. We're here. Exciting. So we're gonna do like option one, which is by the beach, like a day beach pass. I suggest you do it online instead of like paying at the door because it's like 30% <laughs> more. Um, that's one thing that we learned from the trip is to do it online. We didn't because it's I think too late. yeah, it was already too late. We have a tour tomorrow, but for the most part, it's we're here, so we're gonna just have fun. We're gonna eat first and by the beach after. It's so hot, but it's amazing. Guacamole, empanada, camarón, tacos de hamburguesa. You ready for lunch? Super. With this view, amazing view. After the amazing lunch we had at the Azulik Resort Restaurant, we went straight to the famous white sand beach of Mexico. We opted to get our own cabana for shade and more comfort. What can you say with the Azulik trip for the it's day? Worth, I want to say it's worth the price, but it's too expensive. I mean, as a practical Asian like myself, I wouldn't do it, but because I'm with you, then <laughs> might as well do it. It's beautiful, amazing. You should come visit Azulik. <laughs> Hi. We're saying goodbye to Azulik. Okay, are you ready for Kitchen Itza yeah. tour? It's going to be I a think long it's, uh, nine one hour. Of the new seven wonders of the world. It is. Me, I'm, a, I'm at the eighth wonder. <laughs> OTD, check. It's giving Chichen Itza vibe. I've worn this in Jamaica already, but no. get a sustainable fashion. You're wearing it again. This Second. fit you're matching with my sister-in-law, Yana. Shout out to you. She bought this for me, but yes. I'm only using it now. <laughs> <laughs> Ready for Chichen Itza for the OOTD shot. Chichen Itza is one of the new seven wonders of the world. This is my, actually, third time na mapakunta. But it never gets old, so I'm excited to share this experience again with my sister this time around, whose first time is this time in here in Mexico. So join us! Bye! First stop, Cenote. So there was a change in plans because it gets dark early now. So instead of having lunch, we're gonna go swim at the Cenote, which Apple does not like because her makeup will be... It's going to be cenote swimming and chinitza and then left. Cenote, this is my third time here and it never gets cold. The water is freezing but we ended up doing this as a first stop because it gets dark by 5 p.m. so Yo, disfrútenlo, mira. 
Hi, welcome to Chichen Itza. One, two, three, go. And listen to that symbolic sound. One, two, three. As one of the new seven wonders of the world, Chichen Itza is a complex of Mayan ruins on Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula. A massive step pyramid known as El Castillo or Temple of Kukulkan dominates the ancient city, which thrived from around 600 AD to 1200s. Graphic stone carvings survive at structures like the ball court, Temple of the Warriors, and the Wall of the Skulls. If you're familiar with the movie Apocalypto by Mel Gibson, you'll see the settings here at Chichen Itza. Welcome to... Villa de Muchas gracias, México. Espero venir otra vez en el futuro. Hasta la siguiente aventura, Costa Rica. Thank you so much, Mexico. I hope to visit you again in the future. On to the next adventure, Costa Rica. Yeah.